Petty Officer First Class David M. Pepper, age 32. Every week for the past six years, New York Peace Grannies hold a vigil in Rockefeller Center. It started as a protest against the war in Iraq and now includes also the war in Afghanistan. The last week of February 2010, however, wasn't like any other week on Fifth Avenue. More than two dozen grannies against the war, along with other peace groups, stood in a cold, windy Tuesday night to mark the milestone of the 1,000th American name on the list of Afghanistan war casualties. Vaini Boros, an activist and an award-winning Broadway actress, has many reasons for being out in the rain. Rage and outrage and grief and pity for the, um, the, the relatives of the, the dead persons that we, we, whose names we called out. Boros has a message for President Obama, who in December deployed 30,000 additional U.S. soldiers. Bring the troops home. You are in a morass. It's a sinking pit. The Russians couldn't do it, and we can't do it. The vigil continued to the recruiting station in Times Square, where Boros and 17 other grannies were arrested in 2005 for trying to enlist instead of their grandsons. Obama said troops would start coming back home in 16 months. But until then, rain or shine, the grannies will make sure their voices are heard. For the New York City News Service, I am Dana Rappaport. <laughs>